And look, we'll head back out to Chesapeake here as it's Wilson and Grassfield in this one, Matt. Two teams here looking to advance to the next round here in the Eastern Region as we're in the opening round here, and this should be a good one. No question about it. Wilson getting great efforts from senior guard Kalila Alley, also Manasia Finney-Smith, the junior, and Wilson right there striking from deep and inside as Lady Presidents here trying to beat a Grassfield team that made it to the Southeastern District Tournament Championship, losing to Kings Fork in the final. You see that jump shot is in for Derricka Sims of the Lady Grizzlies. Grassfield and Wilson getting on the floor for the loose ball. Wilson comes up with it. It's Ali throwing it up ahead to Finney Smith, and she makes it. The good blow lines for the Finneys. You had brother Ben Finney played Old Dominion, and also brother Dorian Finney Smith of Norcom at Virginia Tech, and it's Wilson on top by 10 in the second quarter. Nice move, pull up jumper will fall. Finney with that jump shot, and it will be Wilson again knocking down the jump shot. And right now, the team in black heating up here on the offensive end. The Grizzlies, though, will answer with a big three-point shot made from the left corner. That was a much-needed tray by Derricka Sims. Grassfield now out on the break, and they find an open player. It's in. Nola Anderson counted for two. Wilson comes right back. Transition plays of their own, and that layup is in as Wilson pointed on here. Ataja Watson, the freshman guard. It's a four-point game, though, as Grassfield's defense starting to get some steals there. You see that one there made by Nola Anderson. Courtney Williams throws it up ahead. And the short jumper is in for Taji Pledger. Yeah, great hustle play coming out of the pressure. This time, Wilson will break the press and knock down the elbow jumper. That's Manasia Finney-Smith. She's red hot right now as Wilson's getting a great performance from her. Grassfield, though, answering with key jumpers. And this is becoming a back and forth tussle. Could go down to the wire. And a big shot made from the outside as Wilson here. Finally able to hit from the outside, but the Grassfield Grizzlies are not going anywhere quickly, Matt. Knocking down jumpers here in both teams right now. Just exchanging uh, blows here as a title fight, but you see the defense here may be the difference, able to get a steal and a transition lane. Two-point game in favor of Wilson is back and forth. One point, three point, two point. This one's going to go down the wire. Manasia Finney-Smith, sometimes you got a star player can put his or her team on their back, and that's what she's doing right now. And then the lay-in inside with the defense concentrating on her, it's a Taja Watson capitalizing. Grizzlies, though, will dribble drive through two defenders. The lane will fall, but the Presidents come right back and score again, and this one will go down to the wire as both teams offensively just in a groove. It's just going to see who makes the play on the defensive end. Erica Sims with a nice shot inside for Grassfield. Finney Smith going baseline for Wilson, and the Lady Presidents stay in the lead. And it's 63 to 59 in favor of Wilson. 34 points from Manasia Finney Smith for Grassfield in the loss. Nola Anderson had 18. Derricka Sims chips in 15. Our Eastern Region Girls Notebook, Matt Lake Taylor, taking on Princess Anne for the sixth time in a row in the Eastern Region Tournament in the semifinals. One will go to states, one season will be over. Finney Smith with those 34 points against Grassfield on a win. And Jada Lucky, nine three pointers versus Western Branch. A very impressive performance for her. Don't forget, we are your exclusive home for the Eastern Region Tournament at the Norfolk Scope, the championship games. You can catch them right here. And more details, go to cox11.com. We've got more highlights. Don't go anywhere. You're watching the Cox 11 Sports Report.